back to my channel okay i'm so sorry i have not been making videos for so long i can't even remember the last video that i made everything has just been so busy and i'm sick right now so that's why my voice is just and that's why i haven't been able to do anything for my youtube or social life or anything because it has all been about Akads, 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 Akads. There's just been so much going on and I didn't have time to film anything for my YouTube, but now I do. And I guess you can tell by the title what that video is. It's an unboxing! So this video is gonna be an unboxing and a review of what I find to be the most popular or the best alternative for Apple AirPods. So as you guys know, AirPods are becoming more and more popular. We see them every day, all the time, but girl, that price though, I can't deal with that price. Like here in the Philippines, it is around 9,000 to 11,000 pesos. That's around 180, 200 ish dollars. I cannot with that price. I seriously cannot. So I'm here to present to you and show you the most student friendly, affordable AirPod alternatives for you. And they work amazing, I guarantee. This is not a scam. This is not a scam, I promise you. I've been using them for days. So without further ado, let us go. So before I show you anything, I have to tell you these are not fake AirPods. It's called the InPods 12. So that is the name of the brand in pods or th that's what these are called as you can see this is what the product looks like this is the white one but uh, we actually bought a white one a pink one and a blue one to show you guys all the different color varieties there are so many colors to choose from I will put them right here so this is what the box looks like when you get it in the mail so if you have this cover on it, that means you bought one of the macaron colors. This is like the, um, the macaron themed one. So there's blue, yellow, pink, and green. And if you guys know me, you know that I had to buy pink ones. So these are like super duper cute, super light pink. If you guys are wondering, these are the same size as AirPods or so I'm told. I don't have AirPods to compare them to. But yeah, these are apparently the same exact size as AirPods. So let me just open this up for you. Ta-da! And if you guys are wondering, this has a matte finish, unlike Apple AirPods, which have a glossy finish, I believe. It's so satisfying. Guys, I'm so sorry about my voice. I'm so sorry. Anyways, so this is the first thing that you see in the box. Then you open this up, and as you can see, it comes with a manual both in Chinese and in English, luckily. So on the manual, you can see all the different kinds of colors. So the top one is the macaron themed ones, and then we have classic colors such as black, navy blue, gray, and white, of course. And we've got all the instructions here. So we're all good to go. And the charger for this is actually a lightning cable. So just like um, iPhone chargers, if you guys can see the newer models. So it comes with this, but you can also use the charger that you have for, uh, if you have an iPhone and stuff like that. These InPods are actually compatible to any device. Apple, Android, laptops, anything that has a Bluetooth feature, these are compatible. So lucky for you. So to answer some of your questions, these InPods do have the touch sense feature. And so as you can see, this little line here at the top, that is the touch sense feature. So that is what's gonna control our pause, play, skip, and volume. And then this little circle here is actually our microphone. And as you can see right now, it's blinking red. But once you connect this to your device, it will stop blinking. Even the inputs here, they are apparently the same size as AirPods. So if I put them in, you can see that they are not too big, but they're not too small. I feel like they, they actually are the same size as AirPods, so as you can see, they don't like fall off or anything, they're pretty stable. The charging time of the box when you charge it is one hour, and then the time of endurance for these InPods are actually two to three hours. I forgot to charge this right after I got it from the mail, but it lasted me like a whole day, and then when I got home, that's when it said that it was low battery, so I think the time of endurance is pretty good. Once you're connected to your device, you can actually listen to your music eight to 15 meters away from your device, apparently. I haven't tested it, but obviously I don't think any of us are gonna be listening to music and 
having our devices elsewhere. The sound is really good. Um, it's not distorted. Hindi siya sabog. Uh, the bass is great. The it's just overall the quality is so good. And this is the best part, guys. It's only 400 pesos. 400 pesos compared to 8,000 to 11,000 pesos na AirPods. 400 pesos. Let's convert that to dollars, shall we? This is eight dollars. This is like eight dollars. Eight dollars for like a really good quality AirPod. I'm. Are you kidding me? This is great. Okay, I'm not, I'm not discouraging. I'm not discouraging anyone from buying real Apple AirPods if you can afford that. And if you want it, go for it. I'm not putting you down. That's awesome if you can afford it. You are blessed. But if you're a student like me and you're looking for some affordable AirPods, this is the thing for you. So now let's get into the function of this thing. So many of you are asking if it has that pop-up screen for AirPods and I'm here to answer that question. So they're out of the box. And there you have it. There it goes. AirPods. Oh, and no, voila. Okay, so that's one of the downsides. It does pop up and it tells you all the battery percentages and stuff, but it doesn't really do it consistently. So you're gonna have to go to your settings and your Bluetooth, and you're gonna look for i12. It's connected. So now we're gonna play some music, and I'm gonna show you the touch feature on this thing and how it works. Okay, so I have my music playing here. So if I press this little line once, that controls the pause and play. There we go. And then if you press it twice, the right in pod will increase the volume and the left in pod will decrease the volume. And then we're gonna press it twice. There we go. And it's telling me my volume is maximized. Let's try it with the other one. I don't want to screen record it so you guys can see it live and know that it's not fake. As you can see, my volume is decreasing. And then, if you press it three times, that is going to skip or go back to the previous song. So let's do it with the right one. There we go. Okay, let's try it with the left one. We're going to go back to the previous songs. There we go. So that is it for the touch sense function. And now let me just show you all the other colors that we got. So we have the pink one, which I showed you. Then we got this blue one. This is actually my sister's. And then we have the white ones, but my dad put it in his bag and it got dirty. So they're kind of discolored at the side here, but you get the idea. And these actually look like the actual Apple AirPods, except for this glowing thing right here. But again, the glowing will stop once it's connected to your device. And they look pretty legit. They look like Apple AirPods. But personally, I wanted to get pink because I love pink. I hope you guys will consider getting these student budget-friendly, affordable AirPods. And again, they are 400 pesos. They are so affordable. And I will link down the exact product that I ordered down below. Also, if you're wondering, once I ordered them, it said I was going to receive them in a week. But I received it uh, two or three days earlier than that, so the product seller is so efficient and they're so easy to talk to and you're just gonna love this product. I promise you if you guys are looking for affordable AirPods, these are the product for you. In Pods 12 guys, I'm gonna link down the exact link to the product that I bought so you guys can go ahead and check it out right now. Anyways. I hope you guys found this video to be absolutely positively helpful for you. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that notification bell. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I also changed my username. It's hey, it's Ellie. I'll put it right here. And all of that jazz, I'm Ellie. Don't forget to keep it simple. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.